This is Twit. I keep waiting for Apple to run out of momentum, run out of steam, and there's no evidence at all. It's the I even thought with I frankly was not thrilled with the new MacBook Pros. They're selling like crazy. Uh, I have to say yeah. the iPhone X is remarkable. Is a, is is in fact a great improvement, and uh, and that means you're going to have an, another incredible quarter. And if they put if they put some of these features, if not all of them, on an iPad Pro, suddenly the iPad's going to take off in big ways. Uh, it's it's going to take another category, right? It's going to need to take a, a category that is not the PC and not the smartphone. Maybe it's AR. It, well, do you credit the rumors that said Apple by 2020 will have, there you go, uh, AR, this is Mark Gurman again, who is very reliable, will have basically spectacles that look like your regular prescription glasses, but have augmented reality built in a computer, a battery, sufficient battery to run it. A heads up Here's display. my question about that story. What does succeed the iPhone mean? What does that actually, what do they actually well, mean by that? I don't think Apple's saying that. Maybe Mark's saying that. Right. That's like yeah, a that, headline writer. Yeah. Nothing is, <laughs> right. Nothing's replacing the smartphone for a very long time because uh, the right? smartphone is so, it'll, it, that, that's going to be a while. That's like everybody's saying, what's the next uh, iPhone? What's the next smartphone? It's like, uh, it, that, that may be a generational kind of product. It's not a huge. AR or VR, maybe. It's not a huge leap to think, though, that if you could make, spectacles much like your standard prescription glasses that had AR that had HoloLens or something like it built in that that would be a, a, a new category that would be a, a market killer right that would be amazing yeah. game changer game changer yeah, yeah. absolutely and of course but Apple's I, I not the only one clearly Microsoft's yeah. working on it Google's working on it yeah but that's, yeah. that's but why I don't think we're there it's going to be a while yeah. The first company that makes it quote unquote magical, that makes it not look obnoxious, that makes it superior to, let's be clear, this experience of uh, where you just stare at the, the screen and you're, I, whenever I go to a cafe, you I see do people that when doing you that. stare at your screen, that's the face you make. That's that weird. is a face I see a lot of people make. Well, they're that's doing Snapchat. I, I'm hateful. Uh, yeah, but no, my I, point is, <laughs> there's, I think there is absolutely room in the crazy tech dreamer world of making something that is on your person at all the time connects you to your work and your social life digitally that could be transformative. I say this as someone who has really fallen for cool things in VR and then tripped over cables yep. and bulk and all this yep. other stuff. I, yep. I just see that I, I'm not saying that's going to happen in two years, but I, I do think that is the race right now, whether that's really possible in terms of size, price, heat. Like there's all kinds of factors, but it doesn't shock me that Apple would say, yeah, we can go quote unquote magical because we've essentially been making the same sort of slab device with a phone for a while. But I that doesn't that, mean they're going to pull it off. I think you can assume it's going to happen. Of course, you can't predict the time frame exactly, but there's nothing required to make that happen that doesn't kind of isn't on the timeline. There's no massive paradigm shift that, that's required, no massive invention that's required to make that happen. Just the standard improvement of battery life, yeah. miniaturization, uh, all of those things are doable. I don't, the I don't secret I think is going to be- 5G is going to help with 5G, this, right? 5G, you're going to have I mean, massive bandwidth. Absolutely. It also just yeah. has to not look stupid. That is probably the, above every other technological Do you think innovation. the AirPods look stupid, Google Sam? Google Glass taught us anything. Yeah, no, yeah. I know Google Glass is dopey, but do you think <laughs> AirPods look, we thought AirPods looked dopey, but you see them everywhere now. I, I think they're okay. I don't think they look dopey. I don't think they're like, oh my God, they're making me look cooler. They're right. acceptable, but I'm, don't ask yeah, me. Yeah, it can't be, it can't be a Jordy style visor. Well, actually, that'd be kind of cool. Yeah, hold the phone. Come on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Come on. <laughs>